One, two, three. Boom. Boom. Predictions. Chica-chica. Three cheers for Ottawa. They think they've got a shot Ottawa. What do you think is going to be the biggest news story of Ottawa this season? Dion Phaneuf? No. Eric Carlson? No. How about Guy Boucher? Uh, as it turns out, he was offered a role in the newest James Bond movie to play the villain, Le Bouche. Tu sais quand tes joueurs sont là puis quand ça fonctionne, puis quand il y a rien qui fonctionne, euh, ça vaut pas la peine de, de, de continuer à, à exténuer certains gars qui ont besoin de cette énergie là pour le prochain. Calgary. Yeehaw. The narrative that me or that council doesn't want a new arena, it just ain't true. Calgary was just completely fed up with the entire situation. Who's going to pay for the stadium? Who's not going to pay for the stadium? This is, of course, an emotional issue for many people. You know, I had a poster of Theo Fleury on my wall when I was a kid. But we have to put the emotions aside. And we have to determine what is the right thing for Calgary. What is the right thing for the citizens? Brian Burke was furious. You don't think you don't think we could find a place to go? You're, with a straight face, you're saying that. Calgary has decided to relocate to Portland. Okay, you just said we had nowhere to go. Winnipeg. It's a Winnipeg Jet. Get it? One of the biggest surprises in the 2018 All-Star Game is that Dustin Bufflin. What? Dustin Bufflin wins NHL's fastest skater at the All-Star Games. <laughs> Montreal Poutine! <laughs> In a bold move, Shea Weber decided to donate $10 million to the Montreal Children's Hospital. The Montreal Canadiens will announce a huge trade, one of the biggest we've ever seen. Shea Weber will be traded for P.K. Subban. Shea Weber will- P.K. Subban. It's a huge trade. It's a huge trade. Shea Weber. For P.K. Subban. Do I really have to say it? Yeah. Vancouver. Hi, I'm from Vancouver. The Vancouver Canucks decided to partner up with CTV and host a reality show called Welcome back to Who Wants to Be the Next Sedins. We're here from our auditions in Vancouver, but don't worry, British Columbia. We're going to be coming to Kelowna, to Richmond, to Coquitlam, and all the mountains everywhere. All you need is to be a professional hockey player and have a twin that also plays professional hockey and you are qualified to be the next Sedins. Edmonton. Woohoo! As if a hundred million dollars over the next eight years wasn't enough, Connor McDavid announced that he signed a partnership endorsement deal with McDonald's Canada. And it's gonna incorporate some new McDavid themed items on the menu. The original McDavid, the double McDavid, the veggie McDavid, the McDavid with sauce, the McDavid with bacon, the McDavid with no bread, but extra McDavid on it, okay? Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm milking it. The six, Toronto. Toronto! Breaking news. According to reports, Lou Lamorello has been arrested. The police found Joffrey Lupel taped up under Lou Lamorello's bed because Lou didn't want him going for a second opinion. Lupel didn't get a second opinion. What Lupel got was two of his fingers broken and a black eye. As it turns out, Lou Lamorello is actually one of Toronto's most notorious mafioso crime syndicate leaders. Don Lamorello, I can't have Lupel on this team. I need you to get rid of him. I cannot confirm nor deny that I will take care of this. 